Now to breaking news from the River Oaks area. Very sadly, one Lamar High School student was killed and a second wounded in the shooting. Right now, police are looking for three suspects. That shooting happened on Bama Lane near Westheimer. That's near Lamar High School. Channel 2's Brittany Jeffers is live at Bentop Hospital with more on this now. Brittany? As you mentioned, one student tragically killed. We learned that another student was also injured after she was grazed by a bullet. Now, I was out at the scene where I spoke with construction workers who tell me that many of them ran, some of them tried to take cover, and some of them tried to step in and help after they heard the gunshots. Gunshots pierced through the air near Bama Lane in Upper Kirby. This video shows a construction worker running. Others, like Pedro Enriquez, tell me they took cover in the street. I get behind the machine because the shots was going that way. That had to be gunshots. <laughs> that th th There was no doubt about it. In shock, Chloe Miller says that she ran out of her apartment and into the street. She saw the 18-year-old victim lying on the ground while a construction worker tried to help him. I had a view of his feet. He's a construction guy. Yeah, he was giving the, the CPR. HPD says the victim, an 18-year-old Lamar student, was pronounced dead at the hospital. Investigators say the teen was standing outside with a fellow student when they were approached by three suspects in a black Subaru. One of them pulled a gun. Once the suspect fired upon the male and the female, the male go went down. That suspect stood over that individual and fired more shots. We will have grief counselors available. HISD notified parents by phone and canceled after school activities. The superintendent also offering condolences. Our children should be able to come to school and learn in a safe environment and they should be safe when they leave. While the investigation continues, students, parents, and the community all trying to make sense of it all. And I was so sad for him. Yeah, he was so young. Now, Houston police tell us that it is still early in the investigation, but they do believe that the shooting may have been targeted. Live here tonight at Ben Taub Hospital, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC Channel 2 News.